This motion at the back is going to move Mosley out of there. Great play design, and they're all going to go ahead and slide that way. Move Mosley out of there. Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. Welcome to the Joe Brady Bunch and his motioning madness mayhem for the Buffalo Bills. In this video, we are going to explore basically every offensive player using motion, including offensive linemen. To start the game, Joe Brady scored points on his first three possessions for the Buffalo Bills as a first-time offensive coordinator. And on the first couple plays, we saw the motion. We're going to see Stefan Diggs go in motion here, and it's not necessarily a jet sweep because you could see Diggs running his motion behind Josh Allen in the shotgun. And we could see here it was actually a design play to Diggs, but Allen decides to keep it. And that's the other discussion here is that Josh Allen's mobility was also using motion and opening up things against this Jets defense. The very next play, Joe Brady calls motion again to Stephon Diggs, but in front of Josh Allen, and the play actually gets thrown to Diggs, but it gets dropped. Joe Brady not only used pre-snap motion, but a lot was in the hands of Josh Allen calling audibles at the line of scrimmage and actually using motion that way. But we see Hardy go from the perimeter on the left side into the slot position on the right side. Josh Allen drops back, moves, uses his motion, and completes a great pass to Dalton Kincaid. Diggs has more motion here. Josh Allen waves him on. He confuses, and we could see the motion from the Jets' defense. They are in man coverage. They are reacting to the Buffalo Bills' offense. And we're going to get some different angles during this video for you guys to take a look at. But Josh Allen fakes the handoff there after using motion, finds Kincaid again, and picks up a few. Now this is the motion I'm talking about from quarterback Josh Allen and using his mobility, a quarterback draw. Obviously, he is using the Jets' motion against them. As the play gets snapped, they're going to read it as a pass. We could see the linebackers covering Kincaid, covering all the wide receiver threats, and Josh Allen keeps it, has a huge crease, and picks up the first down. And this is the mobility here we're talking about with Josh Allen. He could still run it. He could still escape, but slide and not lower his shoulder, stiff arm, or hurdle people. He could still take care of himself by running the football. Here's a different angle of it. You're just going to see the whole open look at that lane just clear out for Josh Allen using the Jets' motion against them. Hardy is in motion on that jet sweep. Josh Allen hands it off to James Cook, which opens up a crease for James Cook to pick up the first down. Josh Allen is going to send Diggs in motion on a jet sweep. He actually fakes the jet sweep to Stefan Diggs. The Jets defense reacts to it, splitting those linebackers, running to the perimeter, and he finds Dalton Kincaid in the middle of the field, opening a crease, making an easy throw. Tony Romo called this out. We're going to see the offensive line, the entire offensive line, using motion here, telling this offensive line, that as the ball is snapped to slide over to their left and protect. And we could see the whole entire offensive line slide over using their motion. But it wasn't only Diggs's jet sweep that created those linebackers in the Jets to start running to the sidelines. They saw the motion on this offensive line motioning to the left, and then it also created a huge open lane for Kincaid to complete an easy pass. And this is what I'm talking about with Josh Allen calling an audible and switching up the formation. After having James Cook and Khalil Shakir as our perimeter threats, Josh Allen calls an audible. We can see Khalil Shakir then moves into the slot. James Cook goes back into his running back position. This just creates so much confusion for the Jets. They're having to mix. They're having to talk on their defense and realign pre-snap. Ty Johnson going against his former team in the New York Jets does an excellent route here. He sells the route that he's going to go deep and he's matched up on CJ Mosley. And you look at Ty Johnson's helmet. He's running like he's going to go deep. C.J. Mosley has to back off thinking that it's going to be a deeper route, but then he immediately turns around for the check down and catches it. So he sells the fact that he's going to be running deep, using his motion to neutralize C.J. Mosley, and then just turn around to catch the check down. Khalil Shakir in motion here, faking the jet sweep. The Bills just hand it off again and look at the running lane. Those Jets linebackers and that entire defense they have to respect the jet sweep. You know, they have to make sure that we don't escape from the outside. 
And, you know, Joe Brady did call a few jet sweeps during this game, although they weren't successful, but it keeps that defense on it. Dalton Kincaid in a little bit of motion here. They don't know what's going on. Sauce Gardner's looking in, and Josh Allen just clears things out and finds James Cook for a great game. We're going to get two angles of it on this play, but Ty Johnson moves in motion here, really confuses the Jets' defense. Josh Allen finds Khalil Shakir. You can clearly see Ty Johnson, right? reacting making this Jets defense respect the motion see him moving over it's in man coverage Josh Allen knows it clears things out and opens a crease Josh Allen calling another audible here moving Quentin Morris this time you could see the play gets called even Khalil Shakir making a little move before the snap and we could clearly see a little run here now there was no pre-snap motion on this play but this goes back to Leslie Frazier's comments on Buffalo News the day after Ken Dorsey was fired, I will link it above. You guys can check that previous video. But Leslie Frazier said teams are not respecting the Buffalo Bills because they know Josh Allen isn't going to run it. But when you have Josh Allen doing stuff like this, escaping the pocket, manipulating the pocket, and then actually running it, later in the game, the Jets defense is thinking, hey, Josh Allen is starting to run it, and we have to pay attention to it. This is fourth and seven, and Josh Allen is just trying to draw the Jets off sides, but we could see Stefan Diggs was actually lined up at the running back spot. They motion him out to the slot. Josh Allen with multiple hard counts here, sends Diggs in more motion. You can even see the offensive line signaling there just really trying to draw him off, but it just proof that we could actually have Diggs line up in the running back spot, move out the slot, move back into the line of scrimmage, move back out. The motion is incredible. Here we have an additional offensive lineman on the field, Edwards, number 76, basically lined up in that tight end position. And what happens here? The Buffalo Bills send him in motion pre-snap, really clears things out, sends a block. Josh Allen has time, finds James Cook, goes incomplete. But just the fact of having an additional offensive lineman out there, motioning them across to the other side, man, they are motion sick. On the very next play, we're going to see a sweep to James Cook, something that I've been preaching about here. But again, it's about utilizing motion. Look at the pull here from Deion Dawkins running down the field. Look at this crease. You know, the Jets don't know what to do. Again, they are motion sick utilizing a lot of moving parts for this Buffalo Bills offense. Josh Allen has James Cook in motion here, and we're going to see almost like a fake quarterback draw, a play action off the quarterback draw. I don't know if I've ever seen anything like this. I mean, Josh Allen has definitely done this, but I think this was more strategic. See Josh Allen keep it, fake the quarterback draw, puts his foot back in the ground, and then decides to pass it doesn't necessarily work out, but it just goes to show you an, an added element to this offense is just incredible using Josh Allen with his own motion and his own personal play action. This touchdown to James Cook was all simply because of motion and creating confusion on the New York Jets defense. This was a complete blown coverage and we're going to get two looks at it. Josh Allen sends James Cook in motion towards the outside. He sees the defender following him, which means man coverage. Josh Allen waves him back to the running back position and notice he's on his left side what happens here is that James Cook runs across the face of Josh Allen to the right side and finds him wide open for a touchdown Tony Romo really breaks this play down we're going to see James Cook and the motioning the the confusion there on the Jets and you're going to see the Jets defender really he's supposed to be covering James Cook and following James Cook and when the ball gets snapped he stays put and James Cook goes to the right finds him wide open that was just a breakdown by the New York Jets the Bills send Khalil Shakir in motion here and what ends up happening we could see number 26 of the Jets having to cover Khalil Shakir in man coverage clears a man out they find Ty Johnson who runs down the sidelines for his first Buffalo Bills touchdown. So it's the Jets sweep to Khalil Shakir that moves the Jets around and then it's like that waggle pass from Josh Allen and really buys in that maybe Josh Allen's going to run it. The Jets defenders kind of run in a little bit and then we find Ty Johnson who breaks loose. The Buffalo Bills and the Joe Brady bunch is using a ton of motion madness 
for this Buffalo Bills offense to create bigger windows for Josh Allen to throw the ball into. And he's also using offensive lineman motioning to create confusion on opposing defenses. The fact of the matter is, this is the same scheme of Ken Dorsey. It's the same plays and everything, but Joe Brady is doing the play calling, and I think he is using a lot more motion pre-snap. Those are the biggest differences between Joe Brady and Ken Dorsey. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, it would really support my efforts to create future videos just like this. If you hit like and subscribe, appreciate you guys all so much. The roadmap to the playoffs has already started beating the Jets onto the Eagles this week. I am hyped up. I hope you guys are too. Comment down below your thoughts about Joe Brady and this new revamped offense for the Buffalo Bills. Appreciate you and go Bills.